everyone and welcome to my channel Willies and Blush. My name is Suzanne and thank you so much for joining me for today's haul video. This is another Black Friday haul, um, our Black Friday order um, from Villainous Wax. I love her like symbol by the way. It's just beautiful. Um, but yeah, so this is my Villainous Wax Black Friday order. Um, this was one of the, was it the first one I put in? I think it was the first one I did, but I could be wrong. It may have been Planet of Hannah and Carly and then Villa Beautiful the next day. I can't remember, uh, or Villa Beautiful, Villainous Wax uh, the next day. But um, it was definitely one I was like game planning for. Like I preloaded or like I had things open, excuse me, had things open, already picked, ready to go. And then, um, Oh, hey, wait a minute. Oh no, okay, sorry. I was looking at my order form and I actually in order, I thought that they were gonna sell out really fast. I actually put in two orders and then they shipped them together. They will combine orders. You just have to send them the actual order numbers for the orders you wanna combine together um, and they will combine them. But, um, I ordered, I was just looking at the sheet and it was like making me be like, wait a minute, I'm missing the grab bag on there. And so I thought it would be like totally sold out within the first like 10 minutes or something. So I grabbed a grab bag first and then I went and did, um, the other items that I wanted that were in stock. So I reordered a few things, ordered a couple of new things. So this is a lot in here. It's like super hefty. Um, I got the large grab bag. I'm kind of wishing I'd gotten one of every size to be honest, but <laughs> I probably don't need to have gotten everyone in every size. So I'm so excited about that too because the grab bag is definitely I just love grab bags. I love the surprise, right? So I'm opening it up. Ooh, we got some kitties in here. And it looks like this is a freebie because I don't think I ordered this at all. So there we go. And then I love that it's the blue. I thought this was actually my um, November sub box, but it is not. When I obviously, when I pulled everything out, I realized, oh, it's not a sub box. Oh, wow, there's so many freebies in here. I'm like finding all these treasures, hidden treasures. So I don't know if it's like literally gonna be in a large, in a bag, or if I'm just gonna have to go through. Oh no, yeah, there's definitely. Oh my gosh, so there's lip balm in here. Okay, so hold on. I'm gonna try to pull everything out first as we, and then freak out over it all because I'm like, oh my gosh, there's a candle in here. Okay, I don't remember everything that was gonna come in the large or how many items you get in the large. It doesn't really say, um, but this is a lot. Like, there's a lot. There's so much. Okay, and it's all amazing. Oh, the lid's coming off that one. No, don't do that. Don't do that, honey. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm like freaking out. Oh my gosh, there's washi in here. Ah, uh, <laughs> I don't remember what, I don't think they were like freebie freebies. Oh my, there's snap bars, whole bunch of them. Because I think that's what I was supposed to get was, I think it was all gonna be snap bars and like larger items. And then maybe some car scents. I think, I think I mentioned candles and car scents in the large one. I think that's, I repurchased a couple of snap bars too. So that that's part of that, but oh my gosh huge snap thing i don't even oh i scoop up a wax i don't i've never used scoop up a wax oh my gosh i'm so excited <laughs> this is why i'm making this a video on its own because i feel like we're gonna be here forever because i'm just gonna be like exclaiming <gasps> oh this this is the christmas thing i ordered that okay <laughs> i was like i'm just like surprising myself because i forgot everything i ordered even though i literally have the the list in front of me i'm like oh wait no i ordered that <laughs> like freaking out over everything oh my gosh okay all right. Okay, let's make sure we got everything. I think that's everything. Nope, nope, missed one. Missed one. Oh, that's new. I think that's a secret or that's a surprise. That's a, um, not a secret or a surprise or a surprise. Well, oh, I can't speak. Okay, it's fine. I'll, I'll mention it in a second. I just want to make sure I have everything and then I'm not also leaving behind little bits of beautiful blue squiggly paper stuff. 
Oh, there we go. I knew I was like, I had a feeling that I was missing something. Why is this? I don't even know. Steep. Is this tea? <gasps> I think this is tea. What? This is steeping in water. Unless there's some like smelly good stuff that I don't know about like steep in water. Ah, it's going in other places. Okay. Just scooting my hands through here just to see like do I feel anything not papery. Okay. I'll definitely completely shake it out before I toss anything. So that way I don't accidentally toss anything important. But for now, let's go with what we've what I've pulled out, which is oh my gosh, a lot. Like <laughs> I just slide it all past you as I try to make space on my table. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so much. I'm so, oh, I'm so excited. I'm so glad I got the large box. Okay, the large grab bag. Ah, okay. Yeah, I think, I think these two are from the frozen sub box, which is what's coming. Yes, yeah, the 1120. This one doesn't have... I've never done scoop of wax before, so I'll have to look into it because I have no idea how you use it. I'm, I'm guess. I mean, I'm assuming you have a spoon and you like scoop it in, but like, oh my gosh, this is just so cool. Okay, and that's a cool candle. I think it's a candle. Yeah, it's a candle. Oh my gosh. Okay, I don't even know where to start, guys. I'm so overwhelmed. <laughs> like, ah. Okay, let's just start. Let's just start. Whew, okay, so this was poured back in July. So this is President's Hall uh, Strawberry and Blueberry Pie with Whipped Cream. This must be a place maybe in Disney World or Disneyland Paris maybe. Because I've never heard of it. And I've been to Disneyland, Disneyland. But maybe it's the place I just don't remember from Disneyland. Did I say Disneyland, Disneyland? <laughs> It's Disneyland, California. Disneyland. Okay. Oh, it smells so good. I'm really smelling the strawberry and blueberry. Oh, it just smells amazing. It smells so fruity and delicious. I love it. Okay, we'll set that aside. I am found. Oh, so this must be another one. So I got a cut. Ooh, so I'll have some extras. Oh, we're losing. there we go so I, i'm definitely gonna have some extras from my sub box so excited about that um so i am found frozen fruit slices glacier water sweetened cinnamon leaf and self-love am i hold on one second yeah it's just because now i'm thinking because i know she i saw that she was going she was willing to combine your no your black friday orders with or your recent orders with your uh sub box orders but i decided since i already was combining those two together i didn't want to add to the mix i mean like combine three orders together so i was just wondering if maybe that's why i'm getting so many things that are frozen themed but I feel like everything else is not, but I can tell everything else is. Oh, here we go. Frozen heart. So maybe I did get people smell better than reindeer. Maybe they did combine my... Yeah, that's... Oh, I will have to look and see if anyone's... done a reveal video as well and got yes he lost in the woods yes okay so i'm gonna separate out anything because i think this is just a leaves so i think this is not from yeah because like that's like frozen style washi definitely right there so i think this actually is is my frozen okay so that would i need to like read the cards i got 
that's what I need to start with. I need to start with what's on the bottom. I was just so overwhelmed because there's just so many things. Okay, this is Happy Snowman. So I think that is with that one. I'm thinking this, probably the lip balm and that one I did not pre-order. That I did not order. This one I did order. Okay, and then this is Enchanted Forest. So I'm guessing that also. Okay, so I think all of this is the grab bag and what I ordered. And then this was the freebie. Okay, so probably when I requested to combine those two orders, they also probably saw that I had the sub box order and put it all together so it would come together, which is fine. Um, like I thought about doing it definitely because see that would explain why I had the frozen freebie. Sticker freebie from Raspberry, Raspberry L Designs. And to the unknown collection st sampler. I love that. She looks... It's kind of sad, but super pretty. Okay. And then we have Wishing You a Season Filled with Sweetness and Love. They had it coming. They had it coming. <laughs> they had it coming all along. I love that song from um, Dapper Diggs from uh not Milan Rouge what's Chicago Dapper Diggs Trading Company and Bonus Wax what's the Dapper Diggs thing from is that this no that says Earth Big so is that the the tea maybe well, this says Pink Ladies so I don't know. I don't know what the tea. I think the tea might be part of the. I'll have to look at um, the somebody else's reveal video of just the sub box, or see if she's revealed what's in the sub box because I honestly don't know. But this is from Earth Babe Creations, and. It's this, oh, it like kind of stuck and rubbed off a bit from the sticker here. Another little, oh, that sticker. Oh, so this is just a little like card, Sydney Ford handcrafted jewelry. And then sticker there, but it kind of stuck. And that looks like a Hercules charm. That's super cute. I'll have to attach it to something to hang it from my stuff but that's definitely like from Hercules so that must be just something left over from one of the other sub boxes or collections maybe that's super cute um and then this was the freebie that was on top wax melt sample yeah very villainous Christmas Christmas greenery peppermint sticks and a dusting of cinnamon mm. I'm getting like a slight bit of peppermint but I'm mostly getting the Christmas greenery this smells like Christmas, like just straight Christmas, which is awesome. Okay, I don't know what the Dapper Diggs Trading Co. thing is for. I'm wondering if this is just an, a, an extra card that they had, like they're kind of clearing things out, but I love it. It's super cute. <laughs> they had it coming. Maybe I'll use this for my Halloween in my Disney um but yeah wishing you a season that's super cute okay so yeah so I definitely think all of this is from to go with frozen I'm not sure if the tea is or not but I'm thinking it's not I'm thinking this tea is just again an extra thing that they had from previous sub boxes maybe um and I'm fairly sure that this is tea because <laughs> it says steep a teaspoon in 212 degree water for two to three minutes. And it's black tea, rose, hibiscus, black tea, yeah. Cotton candy, sugar crunchies, and strawberry flavor. I love tea and I have a little like Keurig thing that you stick in to steep like tea leaves in. Um, so I can definitely make some tea out of this. So I will definitely do that. 
um, at some point. So I'll we'll put that aside over here too. Um, so we have the Peppermint Stick Lip Balm. Uh, it's made from soybean oil, beeswax, sunflower, seed oil, cocoa, seed butter, shea butter, fruit. Uh, some things that I can't read. Oil, aloe leaf, juice, and flavoring. So, simple little lip balm, which is also always awesome to get. I'm going to try it on. It has an interesting texture. But I think that's just the top layer because as I'm rubbing it, that's kind of going away a little bit. But maybe not. But it's like it's got bits in it. But not like big bits. Just like really tiny microscopic bits. But I like it a lot. It feels really good. And it smells amazing. Just like peppermint. I love peppermint lip balms so much. Oh yeah. Oh. It's making my lips feel really small. Soft. Small. I don't know. I'm not speaking words today. So this is Lost in the Woods, Elder Oak Trees, Fresh Eucalyptus, and Burning Love. Mmm, that smells so good. Oh my gosh, I can't even, it smells so familiar. It smells like something very familiar, but I can't quite place it. Sorry, I'm hearing stomping up the stairs, and if my husband comes home, I might have to, to cut off for a second. Okay. Um, happy Snowman, Fresh Snow, Shredded Carrots, Candy, Ginger, and Peppermint Swiss. Ooh, that's going to be interesting with the carrots and ginger. Mmm. That is different. I don't know if I like it or not. It smells smoky for some reason. I don't know. Hmm. It smells different out of the bag. Not as strong. Hmm. I like it out of the bag. But in the bag, I'm getting some really strong smells, and I'm not sure if I like them. So I guess we shall see when I melt this, how I feel about it then, because I'm not sure. Okay, then we have Frozen Heart, Sweet and Floral Love Spell Type Mixed with Icy Peppermint. No idea what Love Spell Type is, but excited to find out. Mmm. Hmm. Hmm. I just sniffed up something into my nose. <laughs> I don't think it was anything from the bag. I think it was just like a fuzzy floating in the air. <laughs> I was just smelling this and it like snuffed up my nose. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it is sweet and floral. I'm not getting much of a peppermint. But these are all definitely some very wintry scents. I'm super excited about adding these to my um, winter air, like... Christmassy winter, um, bring you guys in a little bit more now that we're not in a box, so I don't have to lift things up quite so high. Um, my winter Christmas like section of wax um, that I divided out earlier today, but I am found frozen fruit slices, glacier water, sweetened cinnamon loaf, leaf, leaf, and self love. Aw, I like that. Oh, that smells so good. It smells like this um, potpourri that my aunt used to put in my grandparents' bathroom all the time. It smells so good. It's very nostalgic. Oh, I showed you guys the washi tape is from Raspberry L Designs. That was hanging out off to the side. So I'm going to put that up here now. Okay, then we have Anatolin. Ata Holland. When I'm gonna make Anatolin. That's not an N, Suzanne. That's an H. Ata. I was like gonna say Anatolin. I don't remember that being mentioned in Frozen, but Ata Holland. <laughs> Frosty glaciers, peppermint twists, eucalyptus, and oak moss. So pretty. Oh, I can't wait to find out what how this works. But I also really don't want to scoop into this because it's so pretty. Look at that. 
Oh, it smells so good. And again, I'm getting kind of a smoky smell. And I don't know why. This is a eucalyptus and moss. Hmm. Yeah, I think it's, I'm getting the eucalyptus some more. I don't know what that, that is, but it's very, maybe it's the peppermint? I'm not, peppermint twist. I'm wondering if it's the peppermint twist that I'm smelling because that's what's in the Happy Snowman too is peppermint twists. So I'm thinking, I'm getting, it's the same similar scent I'm getting in this Happy Snowman. So I'm wondering that peppermint twist, what is it twisted with? <laughs> Because I'm like getting a very interesting smell and it does smell minty, but also smoky. I don't know why. Weird nose. I don't, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Pepper, peep, <laughs> people smell better than reindeer, not pepper. Uh, snow covered pine needles, rosemary, spice bay, sweet sugar cookies, and red berries. I'm just going really slow today. I filmed another video and it took me forever to film too. And I'm just like, what? I'm normally faster than this. I'm just in a very like lackadaisical mood. This smells so good. I'm really smelling that pine and the red berries. Not much of the sugar cookie. Hmm. Very intrigued by that one, but really excited to melt it because it does smell really good. I'm intrigued by the other scent notes, if they're going to be there or not. Enchanted forest, ancient rushing rivers, frosted pine trees, and icy Nordic nights. I love that. That sounds amazing. Oh, I could smell it before I even like really popped up in the bag. Yes. Definitely my kind of scent. Oh. I really, really like the pine smell. It's so good. Okay, and then we have Ice Queen. Super pretty blue color. I just love this blue color. This is my favorite color. That right there. That is exactly it. Uh, Ice Queen. Crushed candy cane. Fresh snow. And light blue type. No idea what light blue is. If it comes from Lush. Or if it comes from... Bath and Body Works or somewhere else, but I'm loving the crushed candy cane. Crushed candy cane. Ooh, I can. Oh, that smells like literally like a candy cane. Mm. All I'm really smelling is the candy cane, but that is a okay with me because I love peppermint and I love candy canes. Super excited about that one. Okay, so that is everything that I believe. I might find something in here, but I believe that is everything that falls under the frozen themed November sub box. So now we have my Black Friday order. Oh, so this came with it, obviously. Okay, I'm gonna separate out what I repurchased from what I believe was part of the um grab bag oh so this one oh and this one here we go okay yeah those look like Okay, so these two are also from the Frozen collection. They've got the little Frozen thing and they're both poured in November. So reindeer are better than people. So this one says reindeer, or people smell better than reindeer. And then we have reindeer are better than people. Snow covered pine needles, rosemary spice bay, barn wood and ginger slices. Mm. I definitely think I'm getting the bay a little bit more. And it's got that like, you know that some scents have that thing where it feels like cold air is hitting your nose. It's like that. It's like I'm, I'm smelling winter. Oh, it smells really good for sure. And then 
some things never change pumpkin fall leaves brisk breeze and autumn spices love that so this is all kind of centered i think around frozen but also frozen too mm. oh it smells really good i feel like this could still be a good winter scent but still might be something i want to i want to melt now rather than deep in winter but maybe because it is kind of a it's not warmer but it has that feeling of warmth to it of warmer weather so maybe towards the end so end of winter that would be a good one to be like oh i remember warm weather okay so then these are the things that i ordered separate from the grab bag so i repurchased um she had available some of the um game sub box um that are all of them were available to purchase extras so i got big daddy salty ocean floors metal diving suits and gunpowder that is supposed to be for uncharted and i love it i just finished actually today melting the last of the bar of this so i'm so glad to sell game because i'm so obsessed with it. it smells so good mm, i love it it smells like big daddy it's what it does all right. I love that they call it Big Daddy, too. It's so good. Um, Belmont Clan. Cool cologne, succulent blood orange, and black pepper. This one's for Castlevania. Mm, smells so good. Again, another sort of, like, manly-ish scent. And then we have Lady Croft. Ancient sandalwood, roasting charcoal, tonka beans, and leather straps. And of course, that is for Lara Croft, for Tomb Raider. Mm, I love that leather smell. Oh, that smells so good. So, so good. Like, it smells like a freshly oiled saddle. That's what it smells like. Uh, it smells like the tack room. Like a tack room. Like, oh, it just smells so Okay, so I don't like stuff on my face. It feels like like little things. Like it feels like I snipped glitter or something. Okay, Brewster's Signature Roast. So this was a new one to honor Brewster coming to Animal Crossing. Um, so that perfect coffee house scent with extra pigeon milk. <laughs> Not sure if I ever want to try actual pigeon milk, but <laughs> there it is. Oh my god, that smells like Starbucks. Or really just any coffee house. Like, you walk in and that's just that. Oh, it smells like coffee and baked goods. That's why I'm saying, like, oh my gosh, it smells so good. Oh, it's so good. I love coffee scents so much. Okay. And then we have the, I believe this was called the, I buried the... I've buried the order sheet. I think this was called the Christmas Sampler. What were you called? Mini Christmas Sampler. I thought these would be fun for the bathroom because they're nice and small. But we have Mrs. Claus Secret Stash, Santa Snacks, Island Christmas, Santa's Whiskey, Main Street Christmas, Wassail, oh, Wassail, Wassail, uh, Cinnamon Caramel Swirl, and Christmas Cookies. slide her on out I think she goes this way yep so it's like a little almost like a little snap bar I'm they're all falling out now no go back okay so we'll try each one so Mrs. Claus's secret stash oh I love how smooth this feels mm. oh that smells like cookies I get what her secret stash is now Santa snacks Not really sure. It has a smell. But all I'm smelling is cookies. I'm guessing that's what Santa snacks would be as well. A different kind of cookie. And then we have Island Christmas. It's like that. Some of them have designs on the bot on the other side. But is it hers? Yeah, how she's got like oh there's a little bit yellow, but maybe that's from Island Christmas. So that might not be meant to be there. Oh, that smells like banana. 
Oh, I love that. It smells like banana Laffy Taffy right there. Okay. And then we have the little green one, which is Santa's Whiskey. Has a bit of a musky smell to it. I can't really... Hmm. Intrigued. Like it, but intrigued. So Main Street Christmas. Yeah, this has that wintry kind of Christmassy smell. With sail. With saw. Hmm. Kind of sweet. I just can't place it. Familiar, but I can't place it. Car cinnamon caramel swirl. So that one should be self-explanatory. Smelling the sweet caramel. Little hint of cinnamon. The scents aren't super, super strong. I'm practically having to shove my nose into the wax to get the scent. But I'm sure uh, once they sit for a bit, they'll be fine. Because there's definitely scent there. It's just not overwhelmingly strong like as soon as you smell it. Again, this one smells like cookies. So yeah, super colorful, fun. Kind of fun not knowing exactly what the scent notes are supposed to be. So yeah, well, we shall see how those end up going, but that'd be perfect for the bathroom. Okay, so this is now the grab bag. So we did have the President's Hall one I smelled earlier. That was part of the grab bag. And then I'm just moving the that one over and the very villainous Christmas one. So this one is a candle. It's a little dented and stuff. Um, but Monster by Moonlight. Wolfsbane Blooms, Moonlight Cedar Trees, Smoldering Campfires, Incense, and Feral Musk. It's a four ounce parasoy soy candle from Laughing Crow Candle Co. So this was probably part of their, I think they did like a monster mash sort of thing. Mm. Really musky. See, I can smell the campfire cedar sort of. Incense-y smell, like definitely is there. Yeah, very good, like, Halloween fall scent. So I will definitely hoard that until next Halloween. Okay, so now we have this Witch Please, which is a ready-to-melt. So this is just totally a bunch of brittle. Just completely shredded. It's like a shredded brittle kind of thing I don't really know I've never seen wax package like this before or like come like this before super cool though and lots definitely it doesn't really describe what it is hmm smells familiar like something I've smelled before fruity kind of so pretty good and I would definitely say this is, could be an anytime Hmm. I'm smelling something really familiar. Like, and um, fruit is definitely coming to mind. I'm not really sure exactly. Maybe I'll be able to find this on her website. Um, or in, like, the Facebook group or something. I can ask if someone knows the scent notes for this. Because I'm intrigued to know what it really is. Because it's really familiar. Um really good so we've actually a couple from that same line because they all have the same background on the sticker and they don't have um descriptions on there so this one says banshee flight oh that smells really good Again, what am I getting a hair in my face? I don't really know what keeps coming down and trying to go up my nose. Mmm. Again, I can't really place it exactly, but it's really good. It's definitely on the muskier side. It's not sweet, it's not baked good. It's definitely like musky, floral, earthy. Maybe there's some salty air, kind of like fresh air kind of scent to it, or because flight. 
I'm assuming like air kind of scent to it. And then Spirit Oasis. So these are some Halloween ones. They don't have dates on them either. Mm. Again, another like not floral, not a baked good, not really like sweet, but definitely like a fresh scent to it. Like, an, like another like salty, like another fresh air kind of a thing. Okay, really, really good though. This one I already have. It just came with um, like a little game over or an Xbox controller, a PlayStation controller on top, like a little um, wax thing on it. This one didn't come with anything. So it's Triforce, Rolling Hyrule Hills, and Olives dusted with sea salt and coriander. Remember this one just being really earthy. Yeah, this one smells like literal plants plant matter. Yeah, so this would literally smells like plant matter. Maybe I'll melt it while I'm not at home <laughs> and like my plants can enjoy smelling themselves. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay. All right. Uh, and then this one here is a car diffuser and I was so wanting to get one of these. So I'm so glad I did. Um, you basically just like hang this in your car, just like any other like car scent kind of thing. Um, other than the ones that you like, you know, attach to your, um, air conditioning, like things or whatever they're called. Cause I can't speak words today. Um, you like hang it from your rear view mirror. Um, I was going to say rear view window, but that's not accurate either. Actually it looks like, Oh, I just broke it. Okay. It looks like you would probably do something like, you could probably tie it together, but, oh, I didn't break it, break it. But you could probably do something like that and then just like cinch it to where you would want it to hang so it's not in your way. I love that concept. Easy to hang. Um, and then you have, and then like even if your, because if your mirror is even bigger than this, like it would be easy to, like I just said, you know, like pop this off put it around wherever you want to hang it in your car in around your rear view mirror or whatever and then just put this back on and then kind of tighten it to where you want it to hang so I like that I like that a lot um and then uh yeah so this is leaves crisp leaves blowing through the wind I wonder if it's supposed to smell kind of like the leaves from um what's it called bath and body works I don't really know what that smells like smells like but I can kind of smell it. It's like subtly there. But it does. It smells like just like a really good fall scent. I think you just like. Um, so like that I tightened it. I think you just like loosen it a little bit maybe. I can't remember. I looked it up. Remove plastic stopper. That's right. Before first use. Do not apply. So there's like a stopper. In there. And you remove, oh, that would be why I couldn't smell it correctly. So it'll diffuse through the wood cap. But there's a plastic, I don't know if you can see that, that plastic piece in here. I can't really get it off yet. Um, and I want to wait. I should, okay, no, I'm apparently not going to wait. I'm just going to take it off because I'm a crazy person. I'll go put this in my car right after this video. Um... Ah, I can really not get this off for the life of me. Okay, I'm going to leave it so that I'm not wasting my time doing that. Um, but yeah, there's a plastic stopper. So you remove the plastic stopper according to the directions here. And then you would just screw the lid back on to use. Tip the bottle so oil can soak the cap and then return to upright position. So there you go. So it gives you directions on the bottle, which is lovely. I can definitely feel that I got some oil on my... Yeah, oh no. I like... So definitely be careful with the oil. <laughs> I just like totally wiped off the directions. So let's not get it on the other side with the directions that I need, which is to remember. Um, so yeah, there we go. Made a mess with the oil, but that's how it works. <laughs> Try not to be as messy as me when you do it. So just mind the label. <laughs> it does come off in oil, apparently. <laughs> um, 
rub it together and see if that helps the I'll have to go wash my hands after this. Okay. Just try not to get any more oil on any of the other labels or bags so that I don't melt anything else. Okay. All right. But that smells really, really good now that it's out from the stopper. I cannot stop smelling it. It smells amazing. Okay. I'm like testing it on this one. <laughs> like, am I going to rub it off? Hothead 2.0 fire roasted marshmallows with a salty twist of Acarian water. Love it. Mmm, that smells really good. I'm not smelling marshmallows, but I'm smelling the fire and like salty water smell. Mmm, very, very good. And we have one last hope, dried sage, seagrass, olive branches, and fresh cut grass. Mmm. I normally don't like grass scents, but with the sage, seagrass, and olive, like without everything else, it smells really good. Like I'm getting the grass, but also with everything else, that smells really good. I like it. Oh, I like that. That's cool. That looks cool. Okay. And then the ha, the other one is in a little, oh, it's got a Hades shape on it. That's cool. I like that. Okay, and then this one is jack-o'-lantern, charred pumpkin, caramel drizzles, and freshly dried hay. That'll be interesting. Mmm. Oh, that is so good. The pumpkin and the caramel. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Really, really love it. Really, really love it. Mmm. Okay, and then last, but certainly not least, who are you gonna call? It's another one of those ones that went with the monster ones. It doesn't have a description on it, but it looks like it was in like a little tin. Mm, this one definitely has like a lime kind of scent, I think. I don't know. I'm thinking lime because it's green. But I don't know, it kind of has that scent. I don't know how to describe it. Kind of fruity, but not like sweet fruity. So not like... And then definitely other notes in there. Because I'm. it's definitely not like strong fruit smell. Like it's like citrusy smell, not fruit smell really. But with something else. But alright, so this is <laughs> my very gigantic, crazy, chaotic, as usual, um, haul video of villainous wax i'm really glad that i was going to combine this with another video and i'm so glad i didn't because both of those end up being long ones and this one especially <laughs> had a lot so i think we would have been here for like two hours if i'd done that so um thank you so much for joining me um <laughs> for this video um please comment i'm losing things okay please comment like subscribe if you enjoyed um and i will see you in the next one bye